The question is pass the journal entries rectifying the following errors. 1. What is the correct entry? How it was written in mistake and what should be the rectification entry to rectify the mistake. Then the first one being draw the format and start. The first one being purchases of 10,000 is omitted to be recorded. Very nice. Write down purchases to creditors. Purchases account debited to creditors account 10,000 each. Here it is not written the purchase was on credit. We could have used cash. Purchases account debited to cash account. We could have used. Then there is no wrong entry and rectifying entry is purchases account debited to creditors account. Though it is not written, it is a, it was a credit purchase. It, you should write down purchases to cash. I will advise you to write down purchases account debited to cash account. Being the rectification entry it was not passed anywhere. We passed it now. The narration will be purchases not recorded. Now recorded and rectified. The second one is purchase of office furniture 10,000 was recorded in purchases book. Office furniture account debited or furniture account debited to cash account 10,000. 10,000. It is not mentioned it was a credit purchase of furniture and the, it by mistake written in purchases book as purchases account debited to creditors account 10,000, 10,000. Here there is a mistake. Please write down purchases account debited to cash account. And the rectification will be purchases account debited to furniture account. By mistake I have written creditors. Please rectify this. Purchases account debited to cash account. It was the wrong entry. Now furniture will come. Furniture account debit. Purchases will go. Rectify. For rectification purpose credit this. This will be cancelled. Two purchases account, debit credit cancel. Now you are getting furniture to cash. Third one will be office rent of 1500 was debited to personal account of the landlord. It was just simply the correct entry was rent account debited cash account. 15,000, 15,000. When we paid the rent, we should have debited rent account. But we wrote the person taking the money means landlord account debited to cash. Landlord account debited to cash account. It is landlord's personal account. Or the best word in place of a landlord is landlord's personal account debited to cash. Now rent account debited to landlord account. Rent will come, landlord will go. Hence debit rent to rectify that. Rent account debited 15,000 to landlord account. If there is a mistake in the debit, if we we'll credit this, then this will be nullified to landlord account 15,000. Being rent paid by mistake debited to landlord's personal account now rectified the fourth entry will be old machine was sold for 500 was credited to sales account old machine sold that is cash to machinery fourth fourth is the correct entry is cash account debited to machinery account 5000 5000 this machinery sale is not an ordinary sale of the business in the usual course of business the, mes the company does not deal in machines tools and machinery. Hence, we sold an asset, we wrote it in by mistake sales account. The mistake was, the wrong entry was cash account debited to sales account. The amount is same 5000. There is no mistake in the amount, only the name. In credit, there should be machinery account. By mistake, we wrote in the credit to sales account. Hence, to sales account is to be nullified by debiting this in the debit column, debit row of Rectification journal that is sales account debited to machinery will come to machinery account 5000. The sales which by mistake credited is now debited to nullify the effect and machinery was not written and we wrote it. Being sale of machinery wrongly recorded in by mistake recorded in sales book rectified. The journal of rectification journal is to be total and the totaling of both debit and credit column is rupees 40,000 each. And this is the final answer.